Hello everyone, Ron here from RJJ's Reactions and I am back with The Warning. And the next track from the album Queen of the Murder Scene is Stalker. Uh, sounds a little dangerous, so <laughs> should be interesting though. Uh, all of the reactions I've done to The Warning so far, uh, the music has been incredible. So uh, check those out. There's a playlist for them if you want to go back and check the earlier ones if you haven't already uh, watched those ones. Uh, there's a playlist for any artist that I've done two or more uh, songs for, so you can check them all out in one place if you want to. But you can always mix it up uh, anyway. Just before we jump into the music, if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button, it helps the channel a lot. If you want to help some more, check in the description. There are ways to donate to the channel. There's also a way to bump up your request and get it a lot faster if you want to do that. Thank you to everyone who has already subscribed, donated, sent requests, uh, information about the bands, etc. I want to thank the viewers for introducing me to the band The Warning. I had never heard of them before and it's been a great journey so far. So let's continue that journey with Stalker. Stalker, here we go. Chapter 2. back up a bit don't worry uh, yeah the conviction in Danny's voice is very apparent and of course the lyrics we're going to talk about s separately after but I think uh, crazy is a word that you're hearing clearly and <laughs> I think it's probably real <laughs> true uh, not in real life I, I don't mean Danny's crazy <laughs> but the character in the song uh, yeah but the conviction of her voice and, and the tone of her voice and it's great to to hear them live Andra. Say I'm yours does not sound like a request. It's definitely an imperative. It's definitely a demand. <laughs>
Alina keeping the beat. Uh, they're all excellent at their uh, instruments, and I know they all sing to some extent too. In fact, the very first video I did was uh, Paulina singing <laughs> the drummer, and I I was kind of surprised by that because not often that you see the drummer doing the main lead vocal, but uh, it was impressive. So, but they're all excellent on their instruments as well. pain you can feel. Well, that was excellent. Um, getting deeper into the madness, I think, <laughs> the sound of it. I mean, she's she's literally saying that. So uh, it's going to be an interesting look at the lyrics. I as I, I think I've already said, the instrumentation is amazing. Uh, Danny's vocals, always great to hear uh, a live singer that can commit to this extent. And um, yeah, just excellent. Really good. Let's have a look at the lyrics now. Stalker by the warning. All right. Look at me, my dear. Look at me, my dear. I love you so because I am yours and you are mine. I'll hold you, my dear. I'll hold you, my dear. I'll tie the rope because I am yours and you are mine. So, um, yeah, is this love? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, lust, maybe. Um, misguided love maybe but love love i'm not so sure if you have to tie the rope whether that's literally or figuratively if you're tying someone up emotionally or in any other way uh, i don't think that's really love but it can be misconstrued in a person's mind as love and of course there are stalkers or you know real stalkers who go after celebrities and i guess I'll just average people too but we always hear of the celebrity that's being stalked by a fan with the true meaning of fanatic um, gone too far and uh, you know I mean John Lennon was shot by a fan I mean <laughs> it sounds uh, unbelievable but it's true it's crazy how much I love you it's crazy how much I want you and I agree with the, it's crazy, it's crazy, oh, you don't even know, it's crazy how much I think about you, it's crazy how I can't live without you, it's crazy how my love seems to grow. So if you feel that you can't live without the person, then you can, although you don't agree with it, you can understand sort of how they can go too far sometimes and their thoughts and their actions. And uh, she's saying over and over here, it's crazy. So there's sort of an admission, um, but on the other side of it there's an excuse or there's a reason right because of how much she loves this person how my love seems to grow i'm a maniac again an admission there when it comes to you i'm obsessed with what we both could be the possibilities it's crazy how i need to have it it's crazy it's an ugly habit yes or no whichever i'll have you someday i'll have you forever so regardless of your response regardless of your acceptance of it or not it's going to happen so <laughs> that's why i say love has to be a two-way street so obviously this is someone losing their footing losing their concept of what love really is and it's it's just going to happen it's more of a habit an ugly habit as they say so you feel that you're in love 
or you feel that it is love but not not so much it's going to um, it's obsessive so it, it's it's going to own them but it's also going to own you this habit and uh, you can look at that in many ways look at me my dear look at me my dear I love you so why don't you know that you are mine so why don't you understand that we're supposed to be together you know and we're both supposed to be living this imagination this fantasy that I have in my head a lot of people do this to a lesser extent <laughs> you know this is a story um, but people do that and they they can hurt themselves or even destroy themselves and others emotionally and, and psychologically because they just can't get to grips with the fact that they're separate individuals <laughs> say I'm yours my dear say I'm yours my dear I'll lock the door before you go say it again so again forcing love it's crazy how much I love you how much I want you oh you don't even know how much I think about you how can how I can't live without you how my love seems to grow and of course it's crazy all through there I'm a maniac when it comes to you I'm obsessed with what we both could be uh, so again it's an imagination of what could be or what's possible um, she believes that this is this is possible it's an ugly habit want you to love me touch me let me in your heart want you to want me hunt me like I've done from the start so she wants him to come after her to basically stalk her but she's she's the stalker like I've done from the start um, want you to love me touch me let me in your heart okay same look at me my dear look at me my dear I love you so much because I am yours and you are mine so trapping your love <laughs> basically does it go beyond that I don't know uh, it certainly does at some point given the title of the album and and the way things have, have gone so far uh, look at me my dear look at me my dear I love you so because I am yours and you are mine yeah and like I say that there's no option there there's no choice being given there really uh, it's it's just a demand it's this this is what it is this is going to happen whether you like it or not and I guess you know if you can't live without somebody some people believe that um, and even take action I mean in real life <laughs> this, this is a story but yeah take action to um, we'll die together we'll die together and then we can be and that you know it, it's a I would say a faulty romantic trope but it is definitely a romantic trope in, in many famous stories and plays and novels um, you know isn't it lovely that they die together well no not really <laughs> especially if one is is uh, killing the other one um, or you know dual suicides or something like this that's not so great actually but I know that it is it is a trope out there that, that people people do love but I think because you don't think about it in reality think of it as your own son or daughter or brother or sister or mother or father and you think oh wait a minute it's not so great <laughs> uh, excellent lyrics again um, excellent storyline and the performance was really good also of course uh, Danny's voice is incredible and I, I love to hear singing live and uh, the drumming and the bass work and uh, yeah the sisters are fantastic as you probably already know unless just, this is your first time here and then you should probably go back and watch the songs in order in my playlist <laughs> but uh, nevertheless or, or just go to their channel there will be a link to their channel there that way you can watch it without the, this ugly face in the corner um, but uh, yeah so there'll be a, a link there go and support the artist I like, like their videos so subscribe to them if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do it now thank you to all those who have if you like the video give it a thumbs up uh, hitting the notification bell can also help but I know not everyone wants notifications all the time uh, but if a video gets blocked which I've had several lately get blocked it takes days or longer for them to come through and then you won't necessarily get it in your feet but you can always check back and see if I've done another the warning if that's if that's the one that you're most interested
interested in, I do encourage people to check out other singers, other bands, maybe some you haven't heard before. I got introduced to a lot, including The Warning on this channel, but many others as well that I'd never heard of before. And I'm very happy that I have because some of them have become my favorite singers or bands or groups. <laughs> in the meantime, keep listening, keep having fun. It's Ron from RJJ's Reactions. Bye-bye for now.